mean, I don't see particularly any tears on the tank top, but his body's fucked. <laughs> <laughs> what is up guys and welcome to another episode of Day Reviews. Today gonna to be going over One Punch Man chapter 144. Really? Where the hell is 143? Did I cover that? Hold the fuck off. I don't fucking know. I. Uh, it says 144, and I don't see 143. I don't know what the fuck's going on. Either way, listen, we're just gonna cover this chapter. All right, it says together, all of us are heroes. Just gonna hop right on into this. All right, so you got uh, some type of explosion. Oh, the barrier's coming down. What's this? An aura? No, it's a bunch of balls of light. Wait a. Oh, no! I thought that was a barrier. Oh, that's Homo Zipper out here. I didn't know he could produce that many. I said, no, it's a bunch of balls of light. They're after Tatsumaki. It says, even unlimited power has limits, right? Uh, I don't know. It said, Black Sperm, was it? Have you ever listened to a symphony? Huh? And he starts conducting out here like looking like he's got Sinbun Sakura like mm, Kageyoshi motherfucker. <laughs> no! And I mean Tatsumaki's getting the fuck out of there. I, I would say she need a break but <laughs> there ain't no break bruh. Said it uses every possible sound to bring forth harmony. A thing of ultimate beauty. Ha! Huh. <laughs> Look at this snob here, says Blacksburn. He's making a, a gal. It looks like a fucking galaxy. The grand finale. No, <laughs> a decoy. What? What's happening? She swapped it. She swapped it somewhere in the stream of lights. <laughs> what a petty trick. Oh, so she swapped this, like, I don't know what the fuck she just threw out there. But I guess it's a decoy for herself. Oh, she made, like, oh, the rock decoy thing. All right, same thing she did with, uh, uh, Garochi. <laughs> In the second movement, I'll finish it with a carpet bombing. Oh, my God. This guy, his body's just that of a normal human, ain't it? If that's the case, I bet eventually I can find an opening and get him from behind. This is Black Sperm. Like, I'm. I mean, yeah, I mean, you definitely want to take him out if he's your competition to become the new Monster King. Because, I mean. <laughs> Go right now. He's pretty tough. Tatsumaki finally made her way back to some help. Like, <sighs> Fubuki. Tatsumaki. Sister. Ah, oh, yeah, she's messed up, bro. <sighs> Arms fucked up. Our hands fucked up. No way. For my sister to be in this state. And she's looking. Wait a minute. Does she. Does she just rev up at the sight of looking like. Dang. I'm the older sister. I can't be looking like this in front of my younger sister. Especially she ain't never seen me like that. Nah I gotta. I gotta. I gotta stand up. She might not have known that Fubuki was there. Maybe. Yeah. She she just realized that Fubuki was there. So she was like. Oh shit. You weren't supposed to see me like this. Says. What? I can't believe this. I told them as clear as day that they couldn't allow you to participate. I'll have a few words with Sekingar and the child emperor later. Yeah, she wasn't expecting for Booby to be there. So even even though she like talked to her earlier on, I think she was just kind of like zoned out to where she was like, fuck, there's so much stuff happening. After I killed Garocha, I had somebody attacking me with these like these these balls of light and shit trying to take me out. Now I'm just here and fuck my sister's here. See me like nah fuck that. Fuck all that. Says so Fabuki. Where's this piece of shit that hurt you? Oh yeah. She <laughs> oh no. There's pure balance and rage. 
Wait! Whoa, whoa, you've got it wrong! I came here of my own will, and these injuries are my own doing. She says, calm down. Well, hurry up and go back home then. There's still some fodder left. Oh, man, she's still re referring to him as fodder! If you stick around, you'll get in my way. Oh, my God. You're still going to fight? Any more and you'll die. If you don't stop your you if you don't stop your bleed and she yeah for <laughs> Tatsumaki turns back, you should shut up! You should shut up and step back. It says, Whoa, Tatsumaki, what are you doing? Don't underestimate me. You wouldn't be able to help me in a million years. Fabuki so tries to put a fucking uh, wrap around her, barrier wrap. I won't let you go. You can't hide that you've you've barely got any strength left. You'll die. You really will. Says, you're still saying that? The reason you stopped trusting others was to protect me, right? To protect me from the adults who wanted to use my power. Back then, having a sister that wanted to isolate me was nothing but frightening. So I created my own frat faction and used power to move past that. But then I started to think about what true strength was. And since then, I think I've started to understand you more, little by little. I'll gather strong allies that can e that even you can trust in, and then someday I'll come for you. I won't leave you all by yourself. I'll save you, sister, in a way that you can't do by yourself, because I am a hero. No, oh, what is this? What is this? I like this. No, oh, no, I wasn't expecting any of that. <sighs> come on. Oh, and she is reversed. Yeah, you let your guard down. <laughs> Pew! <laughs> Says, I can't move. You've gotten stronger, Fubuki. Said, so, yeah, that's the way. That's the way. A nice look, not bossing her around, acknowledging her and stuff like that. She says, but I can't go on thinking that anyone will come and save me. If you've grown to be a great hero, then all the more, I have to be a good example. No, because she has a different experience. It's like, hey, I understand you want people out there and you got people that can help you save people. But, hey, I was out here by myself. Blast didn't help me. But he also told me as, as the strongest one out there, he was like, you can't just go around expecting people to save you. You just got to fight like it's just you. And when you fight like that, I mean, you, you on that Jared-ish, man. It's all me. <laughs> all me all day. That's what a hero is, man. A hero saves people. Here it don't look to be saved. Says, please, sister, wait. Blast. You may have saved my sister's life, but you've left a curse on her heart. Damn. Damn. I didn't know she knew about that. And Geno's getting up. Found his jacket like a boss. Threw a jacket over the top of her. It's like, hey, it's all right. It's all right. Take it easy. I know it's cold out here. I'm heading back to back up Tatsumaki. Can't let her be out there by herself. It's like, I'll do what you can't do right now. Says, hey, that's too reckless. She's right. After this young lady put so much work into fixing you, next time you'll explode for sure. For sure. Says, don't worry about me. As long as I don't exert my full power, I won't overheat. If it comes down to it, I'll be her shield, or whatever it takes. Says Demon Cyborg. Since they showed respect to the souls who fought and risked their lives regardless of their capability. GG, that scene with Mugen Rider, or Moomin Rider, yeah! No, no matter what your skill level is, bruh. If you was out here fighting on the front lines, I got respect for you. Says, this is how it must be, right, Sensei? And then, like, uh, Bang's like, hmm, it's gone. It's a good grief. Says, they say youth, tends, youth tend to rush headlong into danger. But he takes it a bit too far. No, he does. He really does, because he's always willing to throw his life on the line. Well then, if we're, help, if we're helping out our lovely leader, I may as well head, head in and do my part too. Says, big bro. Please take care of the young lady. If you find Garu, Garu, let me know. Says, sure. You can follow if you want. 
but I will not take orders. <laughs> Genos, I am not your student. Says, Bang says, I know, I know. You wish you was. Says, Demon Cyborg is a disciple of Kate Baldy. Saitama, understood? Damn. <laughs> Why you just can't be Saitama? Says, good grief. You can't just say a simple thank you. No, you can't. But he's a cyborg. So, I don't know who these motherfuckers are. Wow, it's truly as if the town was never here. What was her name? Tatsumaki? This is even comparable, comparable to a nuclear weapon. <laughs> At any rate, that helps us swing our blades easier. I don't know who... Wait, who's that? I know this guy over here. He's like some uh, fencer type dude. This dude looks like the guy, the the uh, the guy, one of the new tech characters from Tekken, and I don't know who these other guys are, but we, no, really, no, who are these guys? <laughs> Seriously, why are they here? <laughs> and uh, Tank Top Master is trying not to eat, get eaten by gums. Yeah, maybe you need a stronger Tank Top. You can put pry his gums open, but uh, Fat Pig Pig God comes and just smacks in the gum. Said, I mean, Big God out here flexing those. Like, mm. <laughs> oh, no, he's posed up. Gums is not happy. It says, oh, poor baby. Gums really hates having to wait for his meals. Oh, yeah, I forgot Fear Ugly. Literally was out here just beating the shit out of people and ripping them in half. I see Atomic Samurai out there laid out. Says, I <laughs> says oh, no, don't look so scared. I wouldn't do something dirty like take hostages, would I? I promise I'll give him back. I was like, oh, oh no, who is that? Oh, oh no, <laughs> one piece at a time. And he just starts going at his arm. <laughs> so stop it! Oh, he really does it. I thought somebody was gonna stop it. He really just plucks his arm off. Where's old boy at? Uh, EI. E.I., yeah, the one who, who already got an arm missing. Why well, didn't find him and take his other arm? I know it's fucked up, but I just, I'm just i just saying that, that seems more, more so up the alley of what he's trying to accomplish. Meaning Big God. I mean, uh, Fear Ugly. Says, yeah, he's the first one. And he just tosses that bitch. And Gums comes up behind Tank Top Master. Starts chewing on this man Tank Top. I mean, can you chew past the Tank Top? Or is the Tank Top reinforced? Because it looks like, I mean, you think that it just would have been done so, but he switched. He's able to flip to the side. Oh, God, that's a terrible position. Says, ah, oh, master. Says, why are you resisting? Oh, that's where you're supposed to get smashed into a bloody mess. Oh, he just wants to see it. He wants to see it. He's just like this. And he comes down on this guy. Who's random fighter? Oh, he's in one of these suits that's supposed to make you extra strong. That's from these ball, the ball-headed gang from earlier on in the series. Yeah. Yeah. Nah. Wait. And his arm freezes up. Yeah. Tatsumaki's still out here. <sighs> oh, she, she looks like she's about to roll or kill over at any time. Tank Top Master is saved again by Pig, uh, pig God. Tank Top Master, what are you doing, bro? I mean, at the end of the day, his tank top is still clean. Is there's not a tear on it? The strongest tank top of life. And Pig God goes and collects up the people on the ground and just shoves them in his mouth. That's insane. But now he's he, he he's he's getting grabbed by Tank Top Master. Pass on the message to Moomin Rider for me. And Moomin Rider's gonna get that message out to everybody. That's what Moomin Rider's there for. Get the message to Moomin Rider, and Moomin Rider gets the message to everybody else. We will win, and it will be a victory for the heroes who gave up their beds. Their beds? What the hell are you talking about? Uh, okay, Tank Top Master, and he slings Pig God. Tank Top Master? I don't know if, I mean, it's just you and, and Tatsumaki out there, but I don't know if you want to be out there like that, bro. But at the same time, I'm looking at him, he's not really bloodied up. So, I got to give him some endurance points. He ain't staying down. I said, what? Fear or ugly, just getting massively swole. Oh, <laughs> And he breaks out of the psychic uh, 
shackles that Tatsumaki had says tank top turkle forearm caving punch oh, forearm caving punch <laughs> wow uh, oh because he's blocking with his arms so he's like fuck your forearms uh, tank top master still rushing in there oh Oh, 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 I didn't see Tatsumaki slung back. How did Tatsumaki get slung back? Oh, she got slung back from this dude just breaking out. Head just collides with a rock splattered. Oh, just slides down. But no, tank top master, your tank top. Your tank top wasn't enough, bruh. Not enough. You need a whole fucking hoodie, hit. homie. Like, oh my! He said, "Who you say is gonna win?" Fear of Ugly is a man possessed. No, Fear of Ugly is a, or yeah, Fear of Ugly is a fucking monster, bro. This dude, he's been on a rampage the last couple of chapters. <laughs> Not a single one of you is gonna get away. It don't look like it. Yeah, bro. You may need a tank top kit. I thought, I keep thinking somebody's going to save him from getting massacred. But no, they're catching all this full body caving punch. Yeah, this punches him into the dirt. Yeah, he's, he's fucked. Ooh, be with up blood. The tank top. Innocent and invincible. I mean, I'm not, I mean, I don't see particularly any tears on the tank top, but his body's fucked. <laughs> <laughs> no! Oh, vicious, vicious. You want to keep talking? About your tank tops being invincible on some 300 shit. Say you want to be invincible? They call the immortals. Let's put them to the test. No, he said full body. Gave a punch. Full body. Gave it. Full body. Gave it. <laughs> Multiple. Multiple vicious shots. Was he a sacrificial lamb? For the hero? Now listen. Most of the time, in One Punch Man, the only people dying, the only things dying are monsters. Really. I I mean, really. Bad. I've yet to see a monster literally, like, just straight up be able to, to murder somebody, let alone a hero. Okay, it's a point movement writer. Woman Rider should have been done. <laughs> he should have been fucking eviscerated off of first punch by Deep Sea King. But they took it up a notch because Tank Top Master, who's Tank Top, may be in, 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 invincible. It's still on him. Like, Goku shirts don't even stay on him that long. <laughs> But he's broken, bro. In two pieces. Says, hey, <laughs> now you're ground beef. And he's making fucking jokes. And it's actually hilarious. Because it is. Says, better chew real good. And he's fed the gums. Don't want to get it caught in your throat. The look that he has, bro, as he's being fed the gums. Oh, he's dead. He's dead, dead. Oh. Oh, I shouldn't. Listen. Listen. If I see Tank Top Master fully recovered or some shit, I'll call it hacks. That man is done. He's done. He's super dead. That's a new one for me. I was wondering why Tank Top Master was even on the battlefield. He was just there to be fodder, someone to be sacrificed. Good grief. <laughs> now then, as he hovers above Tatsumaki, now that's gonna be, that ain't gonna be the same for you, I mean, it's gonna be a little bit harder than that, but Demon Cyborg is coming, but 
We all know what's gonna happen to Genos. You see what happened to Tank Top Master? Genos gonna get body burned. All right, Genos, that's the end of you. All right. Between Homeless Emperor, Pure Ugly right now is Black Spur may even got involved. Uh, evil Natural Water Gums Ice. Y'all need to bring back Flashy Flash, Saitama, and Blast. Or is it Blast? Yeah, Blast. <laughs> so, uh, nah, but that's the end of the chapter, guys. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.